Right there, like this. I thought it was like reach off the right. We're gonna take that one to the right. The mile is right here. Yeah, yeah. down range the gunner is evaluating a few different tasks to begin with is a manual traverse and elevation depression how that goes is the gunner manually traverses to the rear does a full elevation depresses the barrel fully elevates to a neutral position and then traverses back to the front another crew evolution that we do is loading and stowing the ammo so the crew as a whole loads three full combat uploads inside the hold of the vehicle Two combat uploads are stored in the hole, and one combat upload is stored in the ready boxes. My name is Cobra Flores, I'm 13 LAV crewman. 
for the assessment, this last assessment, I was a driver. So pretty much what the what that consists of is just assessing the gunner. The gunner has the responsibility of keeping track of what's going on while the VC is popped up. You know, searching for targets, the gunner's down here, making sure that the ammo is right, that the um, M242 is working properly, you know, engaging targets, choking targets, always keeping track of, you know, things that go wrong. The gunner's responsibility is, you know, to keep track of all that stuff. The VC is up top, just telling them where to be, when to be there. start out with crew evacuation drill. The purpose of this is if the crew had to evacuate an emergency situation, they exit the vehicle and run 25 meters. Following the crew evacuation drill, the Marines roll into a casback drill. It involves a driver and gunner pulling out a disabled vehicle off the vehicle and 25 meters. tow bar mounted on the logistics equipment and two wire ropes to simulate towing the LG-25 that is done. This is a totally different experience than the most people out here are really used to. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity that no one will ever get to do. The Marines are doing well. They're always giving 100%. We can see the big picture out here. And I'm really a family. So far, it's been good. The weather has not been, but it's, it has not stopped us so far. You know, we've pushed through it, and all we want to do is shoot, kill. And now we're down at the shooting range to these different targets. We're learning how to drive, we're learning how to shoot, how to communicate with our vehicle commander. We make sure that we have good communication within the platoon so that we can work and fulfill the mission. We're more than ready. We've been shooting a lot. We're just excited and thrilled to just get it over with and finish the mission. It is possible and that we can come together and work as one. Kill, 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 kill. This is, this is great training. It's some of the best training I've ever seen anyone have. As uh, normal, normally in uh, second LAR, where I'm from, we don't get half as many rounds as, as everyone's got today. And we have a lot more gunners in, in second LAR. As far as how everyone's doing, First day, as to be expected, was a little sketchy, you know, rough start, but after that, it was it was great. Everyone's straight on point, they're killing targets, they're doing gate, doing what they need to do, doing their drills, the misfire drills, all right? I'm getting the uploaded really quick, everyone's moving fast, it's, it's working very well. As far as the West Coast evaluation, obviously we've been preparing for it, I think we're ready for it, I think it's gonna go well. I think we should see how it, uh, how it pans out, and. Uh, I think everyone here is going to do outstanding. I volunteered because this is going to be the next big thing that's going to happen for the Marine Corps. Is this integration unit is kicking off a whole new Marine Corps. And I want to be a part of history and this is going to be history.